Imagine starting your day in a reality where the needle of a compass points towards the south instead of the north. Scientists caution that the Earth is teetering on the edge of a geomagnetic reversal, a phenomenon with the potential to topple our magnetic orientation. This imminent reversal of Earth's magnetic field has the capacity to disturb various aspects, ranging from satellite communications to the migration patterns of animals, thrusting humanity into an era marked by unparalleled technological challenges. Today, let's explore why the Earth's magnetic poles are flipping and how it will change the world as we know it. The magnetic guidance system that humans and animals have relied upon for centuries is undergoing a remarkable transformation. This occurrence, far from the realm of science fiction, is a real and gradual event that our planet experiences, and it's called a geomagnetic reversal. The Earth's magnetic field acts as a protective shield against the formidable solar winds and cosmic radiation that pose a threat to stripping away our atmosphere and endangering life on Earth. So how does the Earth's magnetic field function? And what triggers a geomagnetic reversal? To answer these questions, we must first venture into the Earth's core. The Earth's core consists of two components, a solid inner core and a fluid outer core. The outer core, predominantly composed of iron and nickel, remains in a perpetual state of turbulent motion. This dynamic movement, combined with the Earth's rotation, produces electric currents within the liquid metal. These currents in turn, generate a magnetic field that extends well beyond the planet's surface into space, forming what we recognize as the magnetosphere. This magnetic field assumes a pivotal role in preserving our planet. Without it, the solar winds, streams of charged particles emanating from the sun, would erode the Earth's atmosphere. The magnetic field deflects these particles, shielding our planet from their potentially catastrophic impact. However, there's a twist. The magnetic field is not static, it's dynamic, undergoing constant changes and occasionally even complete reversals. This brings us to the intriguing differentiation between magnetic and geographic poles. The geographic poles are stationary points where the Earth's axis of rotation intersects its surface. These are the poles that define our maps, the permanent north and south, Nevertheless, the magnetic poles present a stark contrast. They are the locations where the Earth's magnetic field is perpendicular to the surface. Unlike their geographic counterparts, magnetic poles lack permanence. They roam, propelled by the tumultuous movements of the outer core. Throughout Earth's history, the magnetic poles have not only roamed but have also undergone complete reversals. During such an event, the magnetic field weakens and ultimately, the magnetic north and south poles exchange positions. The most recent occurrence transpired around 780,000 years ago, marking a period known as the Brunus Matuyuma Reversal. In a recent and startling revelation, scientists have identified troubling indicators within the Earth's magnetic field, suggesting that we may be approaching another reversal sooner than anticipated. Surprisingly, the current condition of Earth's magnetic field deviates from its historical state. Over the last two centuries, its strength has progressively diminished. While this may appear as a gradual alteration on a human timescale, in the broader context of the planet's timeline, it represents a rapid transformation. The magnetic field strength has decreased by approximately 9% since the 19th century. Although this percentage may not immediately appear substantial, it signals a change that could herald the onset of something far more dramatic. However, the weakening of the magnetic field is not uniform across the globe. There's a specific region where this decline is most pronounced. Known as the South Atlantic Anomaly, stretching from Chile to Zimbabwe, this extensive area experiences a significant dip in magnetic field strength. Even satellites traversing this region are exposed to elevated levels of radiation, posing a risk to their onboard electronics. The South Atlantic Anomaly is thought to be a symptom of intricate processes unfolding deep within the Earth's core. Some scientists propose that it serves as an indication of the magnetic poles gearing up for reversal. Adding to the enigma, 
The motion of the magnetic poles has displayed an unusually swift pace in recent years. The magnetic North Pole, traditionally situated in Canada, has been rapidly shifting towards Siberia. Since the mid-20th century, the rate of this movement has escalated from approximately 15 km per year to around 50 to 60 km per year. This abrupt and unprecedented pole movement perplexes scientists as it defies the recorded history of Earth's magnetic field. Geomagnetic reversals are a regular occurrence in Earth's history. However, what deviates from the norm is the speed and nature of the ongoing changes. The swift weakening of the magnetic field, the expansion of the South Atlantic anomaly, and the accelerated movement of the magnetic poles all suggest the possibility of a geomagnetic reversal occurring much sooner than initially anticipated. But geomagnetic reversals are not abrupt events, they are gradual processes that unfold over thousands of years. The duration of these reversals can vary significantly, typically spanning from 1,000 to 10,000 years. The reasons for this variability are intricate and not entirely understood. However, it is believed that diverse conditions in the outer core, such as variations in temperature, composition, and flow patterns, play a significant role. During a reversal, the magnetic field does not simply switch off and then on with opposite polarity. Instead, the field becomes weaker and more disordered, with multiple north and south poles emerging at various locations around the planet. This phase of a weak and chaotic magnetic field is known as the reversal transition. As the new polarity strengthens over time during a geomagnetic reversal, the multiple poles that initially emerged gradually diminish. Eventually, the Earth is left with a single dominant magnetic north and south pole, but in the opposite orientation to what existed before the reversal. This gradual transition results in a re-established, yet inverted magnetic field configuration on the planet. The significance of geomagnetic reversals lies in the role of the Earth's magnetic field as a protective shield. During a reversal, as the magnetic field weakens and becomes disordered, it becomes less effective at shielding the planet from harmful solar and cosmic radiation. This heightened exposure could have substantial impacts on Earth's atmosphere and climate, as well as on technological systems like satellites and power grids. The potential environmental consequences of a geomagnetic reversal are vast and varied, affecting everything from the air we breathe to the weather patterns we've come to expect. One of the most noteworthy effects of geomagnetic reversals is the alteration in atmospheric chemistry. As the Earth's magnetic field weakens during a reversal, greater amounts of solar and cosmic radiation penetrate the atmosphere. This radiation has the potential to break apart chemical bonds, giving rise to the creation of new compounds or the destruction of existing ones. For example, heightened levels of radiation might lead to increased concentrations of ozone in the stratosphere, while simultaneously causing its depletion at certain altitudes. Indeed, Envisioning daily life under a drastically weakened magnetic field brings forth significant changes. Stepping outside might mean encountering harsher sunlight, elevating the risk of sunburn and skin damage due to increased UV radiation resulting from a thinner ozone layer. Moreover, geomagnetic reversals hold an intriguing connection to mass extinctions and evolutionary changes. The potential environmental shifts caused by altered atmospheric conditions during reversals could play a role in influencing ecosystems and the evolution of various species over time. During periods of weak magnetic fields, increased solar and cosmic radiation could negatively impact the atmosphere and climate, potentially leading to environmental stresses that life forms may find challenging to survive. The heightened radiation during geomagnetic reversals could disrupt the genetic material in organisms, potentially leading to mutations that might be detrimental or, in some cases, could stimulate evolutionary adaptations. This highlights the potential role of geomagnetic reversals in influencing the course of evolution and the survival of various species on our planet. Another immediate and concerning impact of geomagnetic reversals would be on satellites and communication systems. 
Satellites play a pivotal role in various aspects of modern life, including global communication, internet connectivity, weather forecasting, and navigation. Satellites heavily rely on the planet's magnetic field for orientation and navigation. A weakened or disordered magnetic field during a reversal could disrupt satellite operations, posing risks to communication networks and other technological systems that society depends on. In addition, a weakened magnetic field would offer less protection against solar radiation, increasing the risk of damage to the sensitive electronics on board satellites. This radiation could induce short circuits or even cause permanent damage, rendering these satellites inoperable. The potential disruptions extend to earthbound systems as well, particularly electrical grids. The Earth's magnetic field serves as a shield against solar storms, which are bursts of solar wind carrying charged particles toward Earth. Normally, these particles are deflected, but a weakened magnetic field could allow more of them to reach the Earth's atmosphere, potentially leading to disturbances in electrical systems and power grids. Indeed, when these charged particles interact with the Earth's atmosphere, they have the potential to induce strong electrical currents in power lines. This phenomenon could lead to the overloading of electrical grids, causing widespread blackouts. The consequences would be far-reaching, affecting essential services ranging from lighting and heating to internet connectivity and water supply. The vulnerability of our technological systems to space weather underscores the importance of understanding and mitigating the potential impacts of geomagnetic changes on Earth. A geomagnetic reversal would also necessitate a rethinking of our navigation technology and practices. Satellites heavily depend on the Earth's magnetic field for orientation and navigation, and for centuries, mariners have relied on the magnetic compass as a dependable means of navigation. But with the magnetic pole shifting or potentially reversing, the traditional compass could become unreliable and satellites would be inoperable. This would necessitate a shift to alternative forms of navigation, such as GPS systems. However, even GPS systems rely on satellites, which could be affected by geomagnetic reversal. This interdependence underscores the need for strong multifaceted navigation systems that can operate independently of the Earth's magnetic field. It also emphasizes the importance of continued innovation in navigation technology to adapt to these changes and ensure reliable navigation tools in the face of geomagnetic variations. Contrary to some dramatic portrayals, a geomagnetic reversal is not an apocalyptic event that will lead to the end of the world. The Earth has undergone numerous reversals throughout its history, and life has persisted. While a reversal does involve a significant weakening and eventual flipping of the magnetic field, it doesn't mean that the Earth will suddenly become uninhabitable or that it will trigger catastrophic natural disasters. Indeed, it's a common misconception that a geomagnetic reversal would expose the Earth to deadly levels of solar and cosmic radiation, leading to a widespread health crisis. In reality, the atmosphere, particularly the ozone layer, would continue to protect life on Earth from the sun's most harmful rays. The increase in radiation exposure during a reversal would not be drastic enough to cause direct harm to life on Earth. Yet another misconception is that a geomagnetic reversal would cause all electronic systems to fail, plunging the world into chaos. While certain sensitive systems, especially those relying on satellites, might be affected by increased solar radiation, it's unlikely to result in a total technological breakdown. Modern technology is increasingly designed to be resilient against various types of interference, including solar activity. Engineers and designers take into account potential disruptions from space weather and other environmental factors when developing electronic systems. In the face of a potential geomagnetic reversal, preparation and understanding are indeed key. Science plays a crucial role in predicting and monitoring these reversals. Satellites, such as the European Space Agency's SWARM mission, are specifically designed to measure the strength and direction of the Earth's magnetic field, providing crucial data on its current state and potential changes. 
This scientific monitoring allows us to better understand the dynamics of the Earth's magnetic field, anticipate geomagnetic variations, and develop strategies to adapt to any potential impacts on our technological systems. In addition to satellite measurements, scientists analyze geological and archaeological records to understand past geomagnetic reversals. By examining these records, researchers aim to identify patterns or signs that might hint at the timing of future reversals. While predicting the exact timing of a reversal remains challenging, ongoing research in this field provides valuable insights into the probabilities and potential timelines associated with geomagnetic changes. The combination of satellite data, geological records, and ongoing scientific investigations contributes to a more comprehensive understanding of the Earth's magnetic field dynamics and the likelihood of future geomagnetic reversals. What are your thoughts about the upcoming geomagnetic reversal? Leave a reply in the comments section below. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.